so yesterday we were talking about um how people get their music out there especially in our genre of work in the hip-hop world mm -hmm. right yeah what do you have to say because we spoke about money being the factor like an, an underlying factor of how you get your music out there to begin with right definitely do you know definitely. any shiga shiga ways of entering this thing do you need to for example mm -hmm. if a hacker could hack numbers for you do you think it's possible for the career to expand the same way or do we have to go through like a whole pathway and a network of specific people you mean like in terms of streams yeah and distributing your music oh excuse me um i think um maybe there there are there, there are people that of course like uh, do the hackings and stuff i don't know you know but i think it's not i just think it's not genuine in the sure. long run um because if you don't have that fan base there's certain factors that will come into play where you you actually need them like for example if if you have a high number of streams mm -hmm. right and you post a video on instagram and you like it doesn't it doesn't make sense somehow right you yeah. have a big number but your likes are low so you may, you try to make an event about the song that you just dropped mm. who's gonna be there nobody because you've you, you know what i mean so you, you can't actually tell you can't how many it. people fucks with your in, uh, yeah. yeah you know what i'm saying so i think in a in a genuine sense it's always important i think rather look into getting the fans involved and basically getting more fans to be about you and yeah, yeah. which is not a, a easy thing you know but um yeah that's the yeah. best way 100 percent. like mm. let's just keep it genuine at all times yeah um it's very true because a lot of people right now um i mean there's a guy who does um this thing called the climb up it's a it's a page where we celebrate artists as well okay and he's always posting about how new uh, i'll say the new cats in the game always looking up to the old cats or the the, the more legendary cats us now. okay you know, us oh okay now. i i us now. Uh, one time they just immediate just out there. <laughs> but they don't know the process okay. um the process of the work that you are putting in so it's different from someone just entering the studio um well actually i don't know mm -hmm. what, what do you think makes a great poet rapper hip-hop hit actually before i continue like a great poet rapper yeah like is it the person who writes or is it the person who freestyles or does it from the top of their head i don't like who do you think in our in our generation in our industry or people that you know who would you say is succeeding more is it the guys that are writing the work down or is it the guys that are just freestyling and free flowing and doing the most with the talent off the top of their heads I think it's 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 um it depends. Okay. You know, um it depends and it's our kid. There's a kid in space. <laughs> Hello Juju! I'm <laughs> Um <laughs> It depends on you know um Yeah. Yes, you see, it's hard. It's hard because it, it, of beats, bro. Also, beats come into play. I mean, look, you, okay, yeah, okay, right. When we uh, when we speak of success, right? True. There's a lot of things that come into yeah. play. You know what I mean? It's not whether you can freestyle or not. It's a matter of can you get people to be about you enough. Mm. You know what I mean? Or is your mark? Because one, there could be a, a freestyler that doesn't have dope marketing, and there could be someone that doesn't freestyle but has dope marketing True. you know what i mean so i don't think there's that's a big factor in terms of having to make it you know what i mean True. um um you know i think they both have their own uh Win -win greatness and down -downs, yeah you know man. what i mean uniqueness I, oh, and stuff. man i feel that way you know because we are having a lot of uh new people coming up but they're looking up to us to see the formula you understand okay. like what is the formula for this thing and then there's also the marketing element of, um, of performance yeah. and i think that's something that i personally struggle with a lot is the marketing element of also just chantal thomas worldwide yeah um the voice is doing great you know it's it's that it's that it's that but i still don't think i've found my niche 
in, in terms in, of in like terms of when I walk into a space, what's that one thing that characterizes me? Yeah. You know what I mean? It does help boost your career and make you ap- like eloquent Definitely. and a lot more disciplined as well. Definitely. You understand? Definitely. Because I man, we uh, I mean it's it's all great to have one talent going on and on and on. But Beyonce doesn't dance for nothing. If you know what I'm saying. True. Like True. she doesn't have to. Yeah. She doesn't she have doesn't to. She doesn't have to. But there's a reason. She gets that that working, and exactly. it's also like for me, uh, coming from dance, I've always believed like if you're gonna perform, you need to give people like something to enjoy. Like mm. you know what I mean. So like when they leave, they should be like, yo, damn, that oh, show. Nice. Like yeah. that was dope. You know what I mean. And like, oh no, nah, he just came and like he played his music and then he just rocked. You know what yeah. I mean. Like not to say that yo people shouldn't do that or yeah. anything. It's just for me, I'd rather give you guys something more interesting you know what i mean like yeah i'd like to give you a show like things that you won't expect like oh damn i never expected you would do that you know what i mean so yeah i won't lie those are definitely and will always be the i mean it's the high you know what it also shows that the artist is trying to give the audience something physically back more than something that you're listening to you're not in touch with the artist whatsoever but seeing you dancing and us being in that space and you are working you know because yeah. you're working like it's hard work to sing and dance Just, at the same time yeah, yeah, it's yeah, very it's a, it's, yeah. it's a practice thing Definitely. it's a rehearsal thing yeah, it's, yeah, it's oh, a me. sound and lights it's cues it's all of yeah. that do you understand it's a whole thing and it's different like it's completely different if you're a dancer it's different to uh to like rap and yes. dance and Yo, if you're that's, that's if you're a rapper it's hard to you know what i mean so yeah. like having to like put both together and like rock yo. but it's nice yo, yo, it's yo, yo. nice yeah no no, no. i enjoy nice. it i enjoy it I definitely it's beautiful it. you know I what i think um i, st- I think I, the first time i started seeing like rappers starting to move uh-huh. was, a lo- was a lot in kendrick's videos you know um even shout though out the to movement kendrick, yeah, shout out to yo. 